Hi folks, Damon here. So today I'm excited to announce a SQL Explorer for EMR Studio. While EMR Studio is great for working with PySpark or Python scripts, customers often ask for a native SQL environment where they can browse their data catalog and easily construct complex SQL queries. With the new SQL Explorer, you can now easily look at your database tables and run SQL queries without having to embed them in code. Let's take a quick look. Before getting started, you'll need to have EMR Studio set up and running and a user with access to the Glue data catalog. For this demo, I've set this up already and I've got a studio created where I've already created a workspace and we're going to go ahead and take a quick look at that. One of my favorite data sets is this NOAA Global Surface Summary of Day data set on the Registry of Open Data on AWS. It includes data from over 9,000 stations uh, all the way back to 1929 uh, for daily temperature readings. So I've already created a data catalog table that references this data. So let me go back into my new EMR Studio workspace. Down here in the launcher, you can see the SQL Explorer icon there. It's also accessible over here on the left-hand side. In order to use this, you need an EMR cluster with Presto running. Let's go ahead and take a look at the table browser. Inside of SQL Explorer, this accesses your Glue data catalog, and you can see your cluster that you're connected to over here on the left-hand side. You can choose a database. These are all the databases in the Glue data catalog, as well as a table. Once that loads, you can see here, this is my NOAA GSOD PDS table. And of course, we can also look at the schema over here. Once we know what data, what data we're going to work with, we can go ahead and open the editor. Inside the code editor, we can do a quick select star from default.noaa GSOD PDS and run the query. By default, we limit it to the first 100 query results. This goes to the EMR cluster that your EMR studio is attached to and runs the query with Presto and then shows you the results right back here. So you can see here's the station ID and the date, as well as more information about readings from that station. If you want to do a slightly more complex query, we can of course do that. So let's do a count distinct station from there and we'll run that query. While, that's query, while that query is running, we can also go ahead and open a new editor. So we can go ahead and execute multiple simultaneous queries on this data set while we're inside the editor here. So I'll do a go ahead and select star again, and we can see in here, we'll be able to see the results from that SQL query show up down here pretty quickly. This one over here is still running, and we should see the results of that pretty soon as well. When those results are finished, when that query is done running, you can also go ahead and download the results. This will download the results in a CSV file for you that you can go ahead and open and explore locally. So that is the new SQL Explorer inside of EMR Studio. We hope you enjoy it. Uh, to learn more about the SQL Explorer, go ahead, check out the documentation, and feel free to reach out to me on Twitter or YouTube here, and I would love to answer any questions you have. Uh, my handle there is decort in both places, so uh, there you go. Hope you have a good day. Bye.